Hey everyone, listen, if you're finding that it's more and more difficult to get warmed up before playing, foam rolling can help. Foam rolling will increase your flexibility, which will enhance your stretching exercises, and in turn, allow you to move better in your golf swing. Hey, what's up? Chad Eline here with You Launch Performance. Listen, this channel's all about improving your fitness to optimize your performance on the golf course. So if you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button and tap that bell next to it. You'll be notified every Monday when there's a new golf fitness video. And if you find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. Nowadays, we're sitting more than ever and for longer periods of time than ever before. And it not only affects our golf game, but it affects our general ability to move properly. And this leads to longer lasting effects and makes it more difficult for us to do basic movements like bend over to tie our shoe or get out of bed. Now, foam rolling is just a small piece of the puzzle in our overall general fitness and our golf fitness. So there's studies on both sides when it comes to foam rolling. There's some that say foam rolling doesn't complete waste of time, doesn't do anything for you. And there's some that say it's the best thing ever. What most of the studies found is that for the majority of us, foam rolling prior to activity affects our flexibility. Foam rolling acts similar to a deep tissue massage in that it signals to our nervous system to reduce the tension in our muscles. And releasing that tension allows our muscles to be more receptive to stretching. So foam rolling has been found to increase blood flow and circulation, reduce muscle tightness, increase the effects of stretching, and help with muscle recovery. However, that window of flexibility only lasts about 10 minutes. So simply foam rolling won't do much for you, just like simply stretching won't do much for you. It needs to be a part of a full warm-up routine and a full fitness routine in order for that flexibility to stick. Couple things to remember when foam rolling. First off, 30 to 90 seconds on each area until that tenderness subsides. Second, breathe. Breathe deeply. By breathing deeply, it helps us relax, which will then help our muscles relax. If we're trying to relax our muscles and we're all tensed up like, oh, that's really hurt, not gonna work so well. And third, no more than two minutes on any one area. I, I see people foam rolling for 15, 20 minutes. It's, it's overdoing it. All right, so I've got 10 foam rolling techniques to help you with your golf swing. And I've broken them down into four categories. We've got ankle, hip, back, and shoulder. So there's a couple exercises for each of those areas. And again, remember, if, if, with, these with these 10 foam rolling techniques, if you do a minute of each, it's just a 10 minute foam rolling routine which will lead into your stretching, which will lead into your mobility exercises and lead into your strength exercises, right? So we fully integrated a whole fitness routine here, starting with the foam rolling. So let's get into the exercises.
So if you're serious about your golf game, if you're serious about improving your golf fitness, then you need an individualized training program designed specifically for your needs and your goals. So go to youlaunchperformance.com to set up a free call with me so that we can improve your fitness and optimize your performance on the golf course. Okay, so give those foam rolling techniques a shot. 
Listen, again, it's a small piece, but it is a piece of the overall general fitness, right? If we can break up those knots and increase that range of motion, increase that blood flow, it makes our stretching a lot easier. And in turn, makes our mobility exercises and our strength exercises more efficient. As always, if you haven't subscribed, please click that subscribe button. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and found it useful. And if you can share it with any friends or family, that would be extremely helpful. And I'll see you back here next Monday for a new golf fitness video. So take it easy.